everyone. Welcome to Hilltop Camper and RV. My name is Brian Jorstad. I'm standing in front of a 2022 Jayco J Flight SLX 264 bunkhouse. This is the number one selling floor plan for us for an entry level family that's looking to get into something that they can pull with a half ton vehicle. Now, a lot of brands make this floor plan, but it's what Jayco does that separates them from the rest of the industry in terms of quality and construction. I'm gonna start right off up front here. We have a power tongue jack, which is nice for getting the ball hitch up and down off of the hitch. It's just a push of a button, you don't have to crank. Now, Jayco does something down here where they integrate the A-frame. A lot of brands are gonna stack the A-frame below the chassis. This is gonna be integrated so that you've got welding all the way around the A-frame and the ball height is continuous with the rest of the trailer. You've got a pass-through storage compartment up front to give you nice storage for all that you need. And there's also another storage compartment back there underneath the bunks. You'll see that there is a griddle prep here for a Blackstone griddle. Um, and then it's got a quick connect right next to it so that you can put this uh, beam here that they include into that port. And then the tabletop goes on there. And then you can purchase a Blackstone griddle and cook right outside. Jayco has a two year limited warranty bumper to hitch and a three year structural. This is a big deal because most brands in the industry are gonna be a one year bumper to hitch and three year structural. So you're getting double the coverage of warranty. Uh, Jayco uses um, a Magnum truss roof. It's the strongest roof in the RV industry. It's rated at 4,500 pounds and that space that they're using um, is also going to give you maximized insulation space uh, as if you were to compress insulation you lose R values so by having that magnum truss roof it's also helping you with your insulation needs this is a goodyear tire rated at 87 miles per hour comes with a six-year warranty and it's made in the united states this is the best tire out there right now for uh, travel trailers this one comes in at roughly 4700 pounds so it is pullable with a half ton truck. Um, it can sleep eight to 10 people. Uh, you've got the uh, solid step steps that just swing up into the doorway. A um, lot more sturdy and easier to put up and down. Um, there is a key block here for mounting an external TV as well. We provide a TV bracket, but you would have to provide the TV for that. And then you can watch TV out here underneath the awning. Um, again, I did say that not only had the front storage, but this huge uh, outside storage compartment underneath the bunks here. Lots of space for the kids' goods and coolers and whatever the else you might bring. Uh, let's go on inside and take a look at the interior. Once you step into a Jayco J Flight, you're going to notice the difference between our quality and the floor construction. This is a much more solid floor because this is 5 8 inch tongue and groove plywood. Most brands are gonna use OSB and they're not gonna have as many outriggers from the frame rails to the walls to support the floor um, all the way to the wall. Oh, up here in the bedroom, we've got a full-size queen bed and the queen bed comes with gas struts to lift up the bed so that you don't have to hold it up while you're trying to reach in. And notice, like I was talking about the floor, they're using plywood for their bed platforms as well and their dinette platforms where other brands are gonna use a cheaper OSB. You've got storage on both sides of the bed and there is a key block on this side of the wall here that you can mount the TV that you use outside in here into the bedroom so you can transition that easily from inside to out. In the living room area here, you've got a jackknife J-Steel sofa that easily converts into a bed. There is a little bit of storage under there as well. Jayco's got a 13 and a half thousand BTU air conditioner. Now this air conditioner is ducted throughout. So you've got vents that open and close and can turn different directions. A lot of brands are just gonna have a central unit that blows around the unit. This is ducted throughout. So Jayco takes the time to do that. Another nice difference. In the kitchen, you have a huge double bowl sink with a high rise faucet. You've got a direct spark ignition water heater. This runs on gas and electric. Most brands, they're just gonna run on gas. This is gonna save you propane. If you're plugged in at a campground where you're already using their power, you might as well just use the electrical uh, function of the water heater. 
Uh, you've got a very nice Furion stove top. And what I really like about this is when you turn on the dials, it turns from the blue accent light to red so that you know that it's on to remind you. Um, these are a three burner here and that folds over so you can have a nice backsplash. This here is the new Furion 12 volt, eight cubic foot fridge. In this spot, you would normally be able to only have a six cubic foot fridge if you had a gas electric. So this is gonna give you more space and save you propane when you're running down the road. It's just running on your battery and it's gonna get cold faster. You've got a nice size dinette here that also converts into a bed. Digital thermostat for your air conditioner so you don't have to you know, worry about a switch. Uh, you can set your temperatures exactly where you want them and it'll adjust to that. There's a spot for a television bracket here and you've got a stereo with Bluetooth capabilities and an HDMI cord right here. Uh, Jayco's bunks, this is another big difference. Not only are we using higher density foam, uh, they're thicker mattresses and they are rated at 600 pounds for a double bunk. Most brands are gonna be three, 350. So these are good to support adults, um, not just children. And you've got the same rating down below and you've got access to your storage right from here so that you can access the things in your outside storage compartment, put the kids stuff back there. Back here in the bathroom, in the bathroom area here, we've got the sink outside of the bathroom. So somebody can be getting ready while somebody's in the bathroom or uh, taking a shower. And uh, you've got a skylight in the shower and a roof vent with a fan. Thanks for watching the video. Stop on into any of our locations to see the Jayco J-Flight 264 and why it's the number one selling travel trailer in the United States.